Lots of people have talked about how intelligent large language models are. And many people, you know, you've probably been seeing news stories about people forming romantic relationships with chat GPT and then getting upset when the model is updated. Um, but in all of those cases, right, it looks like the thing you're talking to is very intelligent. When you're talking to this system, there is something very intelligent involved in the conversation. It's not ChatGPT. It's you. It's because of your brain, your likelihood to attach meaning to what you hear, because we're evolved to talk to people. So you're talking to somebody that is conscious, right? We, um, it's, right, we have myths attaching consciousness to the earth, to particular um, rivers or oceans or whatever, right? It goes way back in our history. We're used to attaching consciousness to things. And this is, you know, doing very well at mimicking consciousness. So of course we naturally tend to think of it uh, as being intelligent, but there's no intelligence there. There's a lot of cleverness that goes into the design of the system, and we'll talk about some of those things. But none of it is what you would call intelligence. All of it is much more like this, where you're picking things according to frequency. 